Only about a half an hour flight from Kwajalein is the Marshallese island of Likiep. When the plane touches down on this grassy field, the pressures of daily life seem to disappear. There is no television, there are no telephones, and except for the few residents who own generators, no electricity either. But the people here don't seem to mind. This is island life. Visitors to this beautiful place soon realize that wristwatches and alarm clocks have little meaning here. The only time that matters on Likiep is island time. Literally translated, Likiep means purse of treasures. The people who live here spend much of their time fishing, taking it easy, and just plain enjoying life. They are descendants of Jose de Brum and Adolf Capelli, two European businessmen who purchased the island back in the mid-19th century. One of these descendants is Joe de Brum, who runs the island's only hotel, the Plantation House. I was born on Likip in October 31st, 1931. Likib is a beautiful place. It's, a, it's, it's owned by the family. That, uh, I guess in history that the two old men, the, both from my grandfather's side, purchased the island from the Euro Jabalab called Chortaka. And then uh, from there they start a corporate business down the line. All of all of these all of these folks have passed away and here we are today on Likip and uh, my son decided to put a hotel on Likip and here we are and I think uh, it's a good place for quite people to come in and relax. We have a good diving spot, we have a good snorkeling spot. And the fishing is really great. Uh, I encourage Kwajalein, Kwajalein folks to come down and visit for a few days with us. It's almost impossible to spend time on Likiep without learning about Joe's uncle, the late Joachim de Broom. He was a, he was a brilliant man. He wasn't only a scientist, we call it these days, but he was a doctor as well. Uh, he put together a lot of books of Marshallese history, Marshallese medicine books, as well as navigation in the Marshall Islands. Known as a Renaissance man, Joachim was also a superb photographer. His photographs offer rare glimpses into the Marshall Islands of yesterday. Because of this, they have become important documents of Marshallese culture and history. Many of his photographs are on display at the Alele Museum in Majuro and the Marshallese Cultural Center on Kwajalein. The house on Likiep that he himself built still stands today and now it too is a museum. Nearby is the cemetery where he's buried. Almost 70 years after his death, Joachim de Broom's presence is still very much alive on this island. Uh, Richard, uh, what brings you out here to Likiep Atoll? Well, it was time for me to simplify my life. And what were some of the things that made you want to come here? I'd done some research and set up a list of criteria for uh, my new retirement home to uh, meet and traveled to a number of different places and the Marshall Islands and Likiep percolated up to the top of my list. Richard Liebert is an American from Philadelphia who has decided to retire and make Likiep Atoll his home. He currently lives in the hotel, but soon he is hoping to build his own home on one of the nearby islands. After living and working for years in the fast-paced American lifestyle, Likiep and its residents were just the ticket for this expatriate. People in all of the islands in Oceania that I, I visited were uh, very, very friendly. People on Likiep were especially friendly. I feel very, very comfortable here. 
I've been here nearly a year. I've been invited to every uh, public function, every birthday party, and uh, it's just so nice here. It really is amazing. Anywhere in the, in the islands, the idea that the family is the prime unit, not the individual, the physical uh, environment is very, very beautiful but also the people, they have the beauty in their hearts and that makes it very, very easy to live here. Roy Namor resident Mike Jones is a first time visitor to Likiep. He brought with him gifts for some very special people. Well, we passed out some uh, toys and candy to the children up here just as a, you know, a goodwill ambassador type thing and uh, the kids loved it. I've had a really good time here. It's, uh, it's a great getaway. Uh, it's a wonderful island and I've enjoyed myself immensely. The people here are absolutely wonderful. So if you'd like to be like Mike and check out Likiep, Air Marshall Islands flies here round trip from Likiep to Kwajalein and then back to Likiep every Tuesday and Saturday. To make reservations at the Plantation House Hotel, the RMI office on Kwajalein can help you get in touch with Joe. And if the opinions of previous visitors are any indication, you'll want to come here as soon as you can. Well, when you read through the guest book, the two most commonly used words in the comments that the guests leave are peaceful and tranquil. And sometimes it takes people a little while to come down. It took me a little while to get on to Marshall time, but there are some people, as soon as they hit this spot, somehow their watches reset themselves and they get on island time pretty quickly. And as I tell Joe, the rainbows are for free. Once you're here, there's no charge. The sunsets are free once you're here. I like to say to the people on Kwajalein, please come to Likiev. Likiev is a home away from home. For Window on the Atoll, I'm Rich Fagler, AFN Kwajalein.